Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Carlos and welcome to another fragrant review here at Brooklyn Fragrance Lover. Today I'll be reviewing the latest masculine release from Yves Saint Laurent called La Nuit de l'Homme Lentens. The original loan was released in 2006. Since then there have been, I believe, 13 flankers. This latest Lentance version is the 13th flanker. To be perfectly honest, I am not familiar with all of them actually, because the only one that I own is La Nuit de Lom. That is the only one that I'm familiar with. So I guess I won't be comparing Lentance to the rest of the flankers. La Nuit de L'Homme Lentance is classified as an Oriental. It was released in August of 2015. At the moment, it is only available in Europe, so I don't have any information on bottle size or prices or anything. I actually joined the split and that is how I got to smell it. The notes are iris, vanilla, tonka, patchouli, violet, and sage. All right. I wore some to work today and let's see what my co-workers thought of it. What's up? We got Lauren here. She's going to smell my new fragrance here. What do you think, baby? I don't really know how I feel about it. Like, I, I, I don't know if I like it or if I don't like it. Um, if you don't like it, say so. No, I think I feel like it's tolerable for me. I mean, I like it. I feel like it's more of a candle scent. I don't really? Know, really? So no sexy, no sexy buttons and... here. No. Uh, no, it doesn't bones. make me want to jump on you. <laughs> All right, but Lauren, good telling it like it is. <laughs> All right, thank you, baby. Yeah. What's up, Victoria? <laughs> Hi. She got the giggles today, so she's smelling my new fragrance here, and she's gonna tell us what she thinks. Um, I don't know. I get the same candle scent. More masculine though than a girly candle. Um, I don't know. I don't know if I'd want to smell it every day. I don't. I don't think my girlies here are liking it too I much. So I wouldn't want it to smell it every day, but it's like a nice aroma. Cause you typically, she typically likes all the ones yeah, that she tries out for like me, but, but not, this one, no. not feeling it. No, can't. All right. No, too I candy. appreciate. I appreciate it. Anytime. Bye, boo. Anytime. We have Ariana. How are you today, baby? Hi, I'm good, and you? I'm very good. That's so she's going to test out one of my new fragrances here. What do you think, baby? Go ahead. Mmm. Very sexy. The first very sexy. We got some mixed opinions here. The other guys didn't love it so much. No, I like it. It's, it's very sexual. Very sexual? Yeah, huh? like... So you definitely like turn. it for your guys? I would definitely like it for my guys. Just us two. Anything in particular? Does it remind you of anything? Or have you smelled it before? It... I feel like I have smelled it before. It just I can't figure it out. But I, I have smelled it. But it smells really good. So Ariana yes. likes it. I, I agree. Thank you, Mom. No problem. All right. You guys remember Stephanie. How are you doing, Stephanie? Hi. Good. It's the end of the day, and she's doing me a little favor, giving me a little sniff. So uh, what do you think, kid? It smells delicious. It smells delicious. I love it. It's right. definitely one of my favorites. Because the girls on the other side were not liking it at all. <laughs> well, the girls on this side, we love it. All right, so she likes it. You can see this for 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 boyfriend? Definitely. So it's not so old smelling? Mm-mm. Not it, at all. It's sexy. It's very sexy. Very sexy. All very. right. Thank you, Mommy. All right, Stephanie. All right, so this is Tracy. She knew she just started. Welcome, Tracy. <laughs> she's new to the Brooklyn Fragrance Lover thing and smelling my thing, so she's gonna try out my new uh, fragrance here. What do you think, baby? It smells really good. It smells really I like good. It, yeah. What does it smell like to you? It smells like um, like wood s type smell. I like that. So would and you it like? It still lingers and stuff. So that's a. Do good you find it old, on. young? I found like a vintage type of smell with it's that. Vintage. Yeah. Maybe that's me who smells a little vintage. <laughs> Could you see your man wearing this? Yeah. Cool. All right, so Tracy. Thank you, boo.
Well, as you can see, this wasn't a total 100% crowd pleaser. Some girls liked it, some girls didn't. So what did I think of it? I enjoyed wearing this today. It was nice. I could not smell myself though. Usually when I wear a fragrance, I can smell a couple of whiffs here and there. Although I must say that a couple of girls that I passed the work today, they, they said I smelled good as I passed by, but I couldn't smell myself. I got the iris when it first opened, very nice. I got a little bit of vanilla, it's not overly sweet in my opinion, a little pale violet, and the patchouli is barely detectable. But again, nice fragrance, but is it intense? Why do companies call fragrances intense? This new trend of calling everything intense, just, I don't understand it. This fragrance is very nice, but it is far from intense. It wears very close to the skin, as a matter of fact. Okay, the iris. I noticed that on Fragrantica there are a bunch of reviews already saying that it smells like Dior Homme Intense. I sprayed some Dior Homme Intense on my arm just to make sure I'm not crazy, but I definitely do not get a comparison to Lenton's to that. I mean, listen, I can't tell anybody else what they smell, but all I can tell you is what I smell, and I don't get a comparison at all. I mean, just because it contains iris doesn't mean that it smells like Dior Homme Intense, but hey. Anyway, so... Again, this was okay, nothing groundbreaking, it's pleasant, wearable. Am I glad I smelled it? Sure I am. Will I be buying a bottle? I highly doubt it. I'm gonna stick with the original La Nuit de L'Homme. Much better. It lasts longer, I can smell it, and it projects. All right, to sum this all up, the fragrance is nice. The projection is good for the first two hours and then after that it wears close to the skin and longevity is about four to five hours. All right everyone, that is my short and sweet take on La Nuit de L'Homme Lentans. Do you have a favorite from the Yves Saint Laurent L'Homme series? Let me know in the comments down below. Hope you'll subscribe to my channel, tell your friends, and come back soon. Take care. Today I'll be reviewing the latest masculine release from Yves Saint Laurent called La Homme de Nuit de L'Homme, La Rue La Carte. The original... <coughs> the original L'Homme... 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 This review is coming to you based on a decant that I got. I joined the split and uh, that's how I got to smell it because I live in the U.S. I'm definitely going to be sticking with and I'm happier with my La Nuit de L'Homme. Smells much better to me. Projects better. I almost got it in my eye there. I got the iris when I first sprayed it on. You get a little pale violet. A little vanilla. It's not overly sweet in my opinion. And the patchouli. Patchouli? Do you wear patchouli? Now, I noticed on Fragrantica there were quite, there were quite. All I can tell you is what I smell, and to me, it doesn't smell like your home. Your home. <laughs> so, that's my short and sweet take on La Homme, La Delhomme, La I Forgot What It's Called. <laughs>